welcome to this uh, video. I've just landed in Paris. Bonjour from Paris. And I have to do some work. Today I'm meeting tire makers and we're discussing recovered carbon black specifications. Well, first I have to tell you the story about Lionel Sanders in the uh, Kona Triathlon Championships in Hawaii. Now, in this Kona Championship, there were a lot of surprises. All of the three first athletes were young, new generation athletes. Lionel is an athlete I'm following for quite some while. He is posting a lot on his uh, training schedule and um, post-race reviews. I had uh, six 1200s, of which that was a good one. <clears throat> and then I started to feel confident, like, okay, I just had to wake the system up. And he really uh, lays open his uh, training plans and uh, what works and what doesn't work. To me, this is super inspiring. Uh, of course, <laughs> I'm not competing on that level, but uh, I take inspiration from uh, Lionel about uh, how to run better, how to uh, motivate myself. So why is this important for the uh, recovered carbon black industry? I think there should be more exchange between companies about uh, processes, about testing methods, about quality. There should be more collaboration. Now, this is exactly what the Recovered Carbon Black Conference is about. It's a rainy day in Paris. Now, the good news is if two major competitors in the tire industry can work together, tire paralysis companies can do the same. In addition to the sustainability driver now, we have also a market driver for recovered carbon black. But scaling up is not so easy. I think uh, many of the companies will be a little bit late in their scale up uh, plans. The capacity might only come on stream by 2025 instead of 2024. Many of the companies I know also have uh, financial issues in a way that it's easy to get uh, big money in uh, debt but it's very difficult to find bridge or mezzanine financing for R&D engineering and scale-up operations. What is required for the scale-up of the industry? I think uh, collaborations are key. Collaborations like Michelin and Bridgestone are doing it for recovered carbon black, building ecosystems for recycling. The workshop is uh, finished and uh, I'm heading back to uh, Berlin with a uh, late night flight. So uh, have a good weekend all and uh, see you soon. Thank you.